So somehow I missed this news before I made my data download video this morning because otherwise I would have made a much bigger deal about it, you know, because this is absolutely insane. Like this is crazy. And for those of you that uh, missed it as well and you don't know exactly what's going on, let me just quickly fill you in. So as you know, for the last month or so, we've had this awesome Bulma's house sitting event that gave us 10 stones per day. And the idea was that Bandai wanted to give us 350 million stones in total between Global and JP to celebrate the 350 million download celebration. And the event was gonna stay active until that number was reached. And I feel like originally they probably thought that it wouldn't take that long because, you know, like 350 million stones among all the players of Dokkan doesn't seem that insane, right? Like I thought personally that it would only take a week or so, but you know, after the first week, we were only at like under 100 million stones and then two weeks passed and then three weeks passed. And now we're at around 20, Five days, I think, since the event originally went live, and we're still only at 264 million stones distributed, right? And, you know, I guess, I mean, good on Bandai for wanting to stick to their word. They were like, we still want to give out the 350 million stones. So instead of giving out 10 stones per day for each clear, in order to reach the goal quicker, you know, to get to 350 million stones, we're now going to give people 30 stones. 30 stones. That number is not a mistake. 30 stones per clear for the event until we get to 350 million stones. So it says here, um, moreover, the number of dragon stones obtainable as mission rewards will be increased to 30 starting from, uh, that's 4 p.m. Pacific Standard Time on October 4th. The campaign will be available until 350 million Dragon Stones have been obtained between the international version and the Japanese version. Um, okay, so... Like, how can I express how crazy this is? I'm sure a lot of you guys realize just how crazy this is, but... Like, just take into account the fact that, like, an Extreme Z battle event gives 30 stones. Not counting the missions, just the actual event itself, just the stages. A new Extreme Z battle event gives you 30 stones. This event now, I mean as awesome as it was before, is now going to be three times as awesome. It's going to give us 30 stones every day until we get to 350 million and even with this, I expect us to still take a few more days to reach that mark, you know? So potentially we have another like 90 to 120 stones maybe even more i don't really know guys i mean there's a chance i guess that a lot more people will jump in now because they hear about the 30 stones per day but i feel like honestly it's still going to take a few more days so uh, obviously if you weren't doing this event before which you really should have been doing then definitely do it now because 30 stones per day is just stupid man it's just I mean, this is the greatest event of all time, right? Like, I don't think it's even close. This is, that that Bulma event is the single greatest event in Dokkan history. It's already given out something like 250 stones up to this point. And now we're about to get 30 stones per day. So, you know, by the end of it, it's going to be well over 300 stones most likely. Maybe even close to 400. Who knows? But my point is, like, I, I can't believe this. <laughs> I actually can't believe this, guys. I mean, I actually wanted to make a video about this a few days ago. Um, I wanted to just have a quick conversation about how it's taking us so long to actually get to 350 million. And I guess to just have that discussion now, right, since we're already here. But this is really not a complaint, guys. Okay, trust me, I'm not complaining about it. I think it's amazing. But it also calls into question just how many active players there are in Dokkan. Because if you just do some simple math, right? So far, they've given out 264 million stones. 
and it's been, I believe, 25 days. So let me just pull out my calculator here. 264000000 divided by uh, 25 days. Okay, so that's 10,560,000 stones uh, per day, right? And you divide that by the number of stones that each player can get per day. So divide that by 10, that's going to be 1 million and 56,000. Okay, so basically, based on these very, very rough calculations, there are only about a million active players between both versions of the game, which seems kind of low to me. That seems, that, that seems really, really low to me, actually. Like, if this number was just for global, I'd be like, okay, that makes sense, but this is a shared campaign between both sides. The stone count is for both global and JP combined, right? So, um, it's just weird, yeah, that it's taking us this long. And, I mean, you look at the 1 million number, but you have to also think about the fact that there are a lot of people out there with multiple accounts, right? So, a good amount of these people are getting stones on both global and JP at the same time every single day. So, the actual number of active players is probably even less than a million. So, we're celebrating 350 million downloads, but less than a million daily active players. Um, that's not great. That's, that's not awesome. And, of course, for us, right, for like people that play every day and are getting these stones every day, it's perfect. I mean, it's the fact that we have like not that many people actually collecting the stones that we're getting 30 stones per day now so i guess i should be thankful for the fact that there aren't a lot of like active players but i mean is this a bad sign for the future of the game maybe like the fact that this is a huge celebration right like the download celebration every year the worldwide celebration is one of the biggest celebrations in dokkan next to the anniversary i mean you could argue that the worldwide celebration is actually bigger than the anniversary just because it's a joint celebration between Global and JP at the same time. Um, that's a different debate for a different day. I'm not saying that it's bigger than the anniversary necessarily. I'm just saying as major of a celebration as this is, you would have expected more people to be doing the events daily, especially this event where it's so easy to get your free stones every day. Um, just kind of a weird situation. Like, I don't know if I should be really happy, which I am, right? Really happy about the stones but also kind of concerned about the length of time. Like, I know for a fact that Bandai was not expecting this. Okay, I don't think Bandai and Akatsuki wanted to give out this many stones. Like, they wanted to be generous, but I don't think they wanted to give out this many stones for the Bulma event, you know? Like, because in the past, we've had the launch event and uh, other things kind of like it, where we got 10 stones per day, but it was only like 70 in total or 100 in total. So maybe this time they were like, we'll be more generous, we'll give out 150 stones to 200 stones for this Bulma event. But I doubt they thought they were giving out 300 plus, maybe even close to 400, right, by the end of things. So, um, that's all I really gotta say, man. I mean, let me know what you guys think in the comments uh, about this situation. Obviously, I'm sure most of you guys are very happy about the number of stones, especially now that we're getting 30, but uh, at the same time, do you think this is a bad sign for Dokkan? Do you think that the fact that, you know, just based on these numbers, like I don't have any actual stats, I, I haven't seen like any actual uh, monthly users or whatever, like statistics, right? So I can't say for a fact, but, you know, just doing some quick calculations with the number of stones given out so far and the number of days it's been, um, there aren't a ton of people worldwide that are playing Dokkan every single day. Obviously, there's a lot more casual players. Maybe there's just a bunch of people that do play here and there that aren't really keeping track of, like, the new event. So they don't know that this, you know, like, daily stone event thing is actually even happening. That's a possibility. But, um, still, like, it's been surprising to both me and I'm sure Bandai and Akatsuki that... Uh, so far, we've only reached 264 million stones. Um, I hope that this event's still around for another week, because that would be like another 210 stones we can get for free. I doubt it's going to take that long now with the 30 stones daily, but uh, 
We'll see. Anyways, guys, go get your stones. Make sure, if you haven't been doing so already, make sure to do this event every single day that is available because 30 stones per day, man, is just way too good to pass up. I mean, we're probably not going to get another chance like this uh, anywhere in the near future, right? Like, I think they'll learn from this and they'll probably set, like, less ambitious goals after this. But for the time being, this is a thing. And, uh, yeah, you know what? Before we go, just because of how happy I am about this whole situation, <laughs> I'm going to do one more multi, man. I've been doing so many, like, off-camera multis trying to get my first copy of uh, Gohan and Piccolo. Or, sorry, no, Gohan. <laughs> Gohan and Krillin and it's just not happening guys like I don't know I don't know why I don't know why but hey with all these free stones all these additional free stones we're getting now from the Momo event I can just keep trying I guess I'll just keep trying until the uh, Gohan banner drops which is gonna be in about two or three days um, actually two days I think about two days so yeah uh, doesn't look like we're gonna get anything here but that's not a big deal uh, maybe there's still a chance. Wow. <laughs> okay, so not exactly the joint LR I was hoping for. Damn, man, that's that that's really good, but I <sighs> can't use that anymore. That sucks. Well, what can you do? What can you do? It is what it is. At least we pulled an LR. At least to pull an LR. Um, that's gonna be the video, guys, man. I'm I'm done talking. I just wanted to get this out there, wanted to get it off my chest. And uh, once again, man, let me know your opinions in the comments about all this stuff. And as always, if you guys liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button. To join the Tiger Squad now, and while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Video. Signing out.